Hi, everyone. It's Donna DePonio, Wine Advisor with Wines for Humanity. I help you learn about and enjoy fine wines uh, in a fun social way while raising funds for charity. It is Wine Down Wednesday, where every other Wednesday I will feature one of our wonderful wines. And today I'm going to be talking about our Primi Posse Moscato. And this is so opportune because it is the holidays and why not have a bubbly for the holidays? So um, I will not be going through the five S's of wine tasting like I normally do because this is a bubbly or a sparkling wine. We don't swirl the wines, which is one of the S's because if we do, the bubbles will go flat or the bubbles will disappear and the wine will go flat and we don't want that. Um, plus, you want to use a flute glass whenever you're enjoying a glass of champagne or a bubbly like our Moscato. And the reason being is because um, it allows the bubbles to rise up to the surface and you get that nice bubbly effervescent um, texture to that wine. Okay, so uh, as I mentioned, this is Moscato. It's 100% Moscato Bianco grape. It comes from the northern part of Italy called Veneto, and it's very light and refreshing, uh, very low in alcohol. It only has about 8%, and it's got some, uh, some aromas and flavors of peach and apricot, so it's, it's sweet, but not syrupy sweet. It's just kind of a nice, light sweetness, and because of its sweet, sweetness, it does go very well with anything spicy. And it also goes well with anything salty. So if you were going to have an appetizer, let's say a prosciutto wrapped around a melon, this would be an excellent pairing for that because the sweetness of the Moscato and the saltiness of the prosciutto makes a wonderful um, pair. You know how they say opposites attract. Uh, sometimes with wine and food, the same thing happens. Um, also, it can be a great dessert wine. So it goes very well with white chocolate, uh, a fruit tart with whipped cream. And yes, I have tried this and it's wonderful, is pumpkin pie with whipped cream. Wonderful. So anyways, that's a little bit about our Moscato. So if you want to learn about this wine and all of our other wines, the best way to do so is to host a tasting. It is so easy. It is fun. It is affordable. It's the best deal in town. It's only $69 plus tax, which gives you seven bottles of wine to be enjoyed up to 18 people in the privacy of your home. So the other thing is our CEO, Anton, is so appreciative for anyone hosting the tasting that as a thank you, you get your choice of a couple of different host gifts. One of them is this huge big bottle of Prosecco. And that is the equivalent of two bottles of wine. So we're not, you know, we're not talking, you know, a corkscrew or anything like that for a gift. We're talking a nice, huge bottle of wine. The other thing, let me go down here and grab this. This is our charcuterie board, which in, is in the shape of wine bottles. And it is so awesome. It is very different and unique in each of the, um, the, charcuterie board wine bottles. They separate from each other. It has a little slot in it so you can put your wine glass in it and have your own mini charcuterie board. It is awesome. So all you have to do is either message me on Facebook or you can call me at 248-231-0139 or you can email me vinodeponio at gmail.com. And I know it's the holiday time and everybody's running around and, and meeting family and friends and whatever. But you know what? After the first of the year, nothing's going on. Why not host a wine tasting? It is the best time of year to host. The holidays are over. There's a little bit of a letdown, nothing to look forward to. Well, yes, there is a Wines for Humanity wine tasting. And the best part is, forgot to tell you this, but the best part is, that nine to 12 and a half percent off the bottle price of each wine selected at your tasting will go to a charity of your choice. So you get to pick. So, I mean, it's affordable, it's fun, it's social, it's educational, 
It gives back to charity. By the way, our wines are wonderful. So all that just for you. So again, you've got my information. So again, um, thanks for sipping with me. Although I didn't really sip today, I just mainly talked about the wine. That's because I'm gifting this to one of my good friends who loves Moscato, but don't tell her. So again, thanks for sipping with me and I will see you next time. Thanks so much. I'm signing off.